All right, so tomorrow is gonna be January 9th, which is a Tuesday, and that means Rockstar's tunables are actually set to update, which means we're gonna be getting a new event week that's likely gonna be filled with a new vehicle, new content, and a whole lot more. So before we jump into that, let's talk about everything that's gonna be ending, your last chance to take advantage of some opportunities. The first is gonna be saving big on select vehicles. So Rockstar says, what better than the new year to pick up a fresh ride through January 8th, which is today. There's significant discounts on a wide array of vehicles, including 50% off the mobile operation center cabs, like the Phantom Custom, the Hauler Custom, the Coil Cyclone Supercar, which is 30% off, the Grati Vision Supercar, 25% off. The Ocelot Ardent, which is a weaponized vehicle, 25% off. The FH1 Hunter, both the Buy It Now and the Trade Price is 25% off. The P45 Nakoda, Buy It Now and Trade Price is 25% off. And then same with the HVY APC, it is also 25% off. So some actually really nice vehicles on there if you haven't picked them up and you want them those are probably gonna be the biggest and best discounts you'll be receiving on it, especially like something on the Coil Cyclone and the Grati Vision, those two supercars. Uh, that's a pretty nice deal right there. You've then got the premium race and time trial. The premium race is dual, and then the time trial is up and at them. So I ha don't think I've done either of them, so I can't tell you how easy or hard they're gonna be. And then our two adversary modes are Slasher and Occupy, and their double money in RP is gonna be ending. You can see Slasher has been going on for like three, two and a half weeks now. Uh, and same with Occupy too. It's been going on for a long time. So all of those discounts, bonuses, and sales are gonna be ending today on January 8th, 2018. However, as you know, the way Rockstar's tunables work, they're gonna update sometime early Tuesday morning, likely around 4.30 or 5 a.m. And that is when the current discounts you just saw me read off are gonna be ending. So if you wake up really early or you're a late night gamer on Tuesday, or I should say early morning on Tuesday, you're still gonna have time to take advantage of some of these sales, discounts, and more. However, let's move on to Tuesday itself and what could potentially be coming out tomorrow as far as vehicles go. Now there's only two options as far as what vehicle we could be getting tomorrow. If it's gonna come from the Southern San Andreas Super Auto site, that vehicle is going to be the only one remaining on there, and that is gonna be the Canis Camacho, which is a four-seater off-road vehicle for $345,000. I'm incredibly excited about this vehicle because of its off-road capabilities, its amazing customization, its unique appearance and body style, and so much more. So I would be very excited if that vehicle were to arrive and then the vehicle on the legendary motorsports is going to be the Lampadati Viserys, a two-seater sports classic vehicle for $875,000. And even though I said sports classic, this thing is truly a retro supercar. It has a lot of amazing customization. It's also weaponized as well. You can put the machine guns on the front. So I'd definitely be excited if Rockstar released this vehicle as well. It would be a ton of fun to see them add this into the game. So that right there are your two vehicle options as far as what could release. Obviously the rest of them on the Legendary Motorsports site are all subject to the Viserys coming out first. So there's not a, a chance that they could be released. And then of course, if it's the Camacho, then we're totally done with the Southern San Andreas Super Auto site. And we're gonna be strictly focusing in the future on the legendary motorsports one now that's not the only thing that could come out tomorrow there's also two unreleased adversary modes in the file and i've stated that rockstar is likely going to release one of those adversary modes in january one of them in february so one of those adversary modes is hardest target which again i'm really not too sure what that could be and then the other one is air quota which we know is going to involve some sort of aircrafts because it involves like the thruster, the hunter, the Nakoda, etc. So it's going to be vehicles like that. So I'm not sure which one of those honestly sounds more exciting. I will say Slashers and Occupy were both really good adversary modes. So hopefully Rockstar continue that positive trend with the unreleased two. I don't know if we'll be getting one tomorrow, but there is a chance. So expect a new adversary mode to release or at least the potential of one to release tomorrow. Now, in addition to that, Rockstar are gonna continue to do what they normally do with event weeks. There's gonna be discounts, bonuses, sales, ways to make double money in RP, hopefully. The discounts on the last set of select vehicles were really great. So I do hope Rockstar continues that. This also could be the first week in which we might start to see some of the items from the Doomsday Heist update starting to get discounted just a little bit. 
I wouldn't say every item, but maybe one or two things potentially could get a discount. So if that is the case, that will be pretty cool. There's going to be a new premium race. There's going to be a new time trial as per usual, and it will likely only last one week. I would actually be kind of shocked if Rockstar went any farther than that and if they decided to make it 10 days or two weeks. I don't know why they would do that, but just expect it to be one week long. My prediction is we're going to be getting one new vehicle tomorrow and then just the bonuses. I think that it might be too early in January for Rockstar to do an adversary mode, but who knows? They might prove me wrong and they might release one of them tomorrow. But either way, it's going to be exciting. I'll be up early for you guys. We'll be doing a live stream of whatever new content is added uh, and we'll be showing it off and so much more. But anyways, that's all the information I've got for you guys in this video today. Let me know in the comments section down below what vehicle do you think is going to be coming out tomorrow do you think it's going to be the viscerous do you think it's going to be the canis camacho i'd love to hear from you guys down there if you did go on to enjoy this video though a like rating would of course be awesome and also subscribe to my youtube channel if you are new or you like daily gta 5 videos like this with all the way guys like i said thanks so much for watching take care and i'll see you guys in the next video